Hello, Sean O'Hare, welcome back to the channel. On this video, we've got a lane in uh, Lancashire, just around the Gerstang area, near the forest of Borland. Hope you enjoy it. First one for me again. We'll see where it goes. Back into the video, we'll have maps and the grid reference and Trailwise 2 reference if you want to drive it. This seems a bit first part of the lane. Like I said, I've never drove it before, so let's see what's in front of us. At this stage, not too bad. Reasonable width, not scratchy at all. So far, so good. A few hundred yards onto the lane, we came across this little bit of a water section. This was probably the first little bit of an obstacle we came across. Nothing major. Some of you probably realise that the old Toyota's back. That's due to the patrol still not being ready. Issues again beyond both man and Simon's control. So the Toyota's come out of retirement. I got sick of waiting. I needed a bit of a fix on the lane, so here it is. Good to be back in it. I've got to say up to now this lane not too difficult at all but a nice lane if you know what I mean by that again I'll repeat myself not too narrow not too scratchy just need to watch where you're going yeah a good one for everybody really make our way down downhill gradient was nothing too too steep again At this stage of the lane you could see we're sort of more or less coming to a bottom of the hill. Again, first time I've drove it, didn't really know what was coming around the next corner. It does give you a buzz though when you're driving a lane for the first time. It does for me anyway, much prefer it, you never know what's coming around that next corner. And as we hit the corner, we could see the Ford in the uh, in the distance there. Probably the highlight of the lane as well in Furnace. Going through the water crossing, no dramas. Obviously, water level as you can see wasn't high. I suppose you'd just have to be a little bit more careful if it was. It may sort of go over those boulders and rocks. You just need to watch your undercarriage if it goes a little bit higher. Just probably aim for the middle of that um, entrance of it as you're coming up. As we came out, had this little bit of a climb again. We have gone downhill previously, so obviously we're going back up now. Once you've gone past the ford at the bottom, you turn right and then you come into this 
it's a gentle little climb a little bit rocky and this is where the sort of last gate is before you hit the, um, the tarmac all in all I think it's a good little lane it's about the same width all the way through not particularly scratchy not particularly difficult but just a nice little lane floor at the bottom is probably the highlight of it and then it links you up with about three four five maybe more what's in that sort of Trafford Borland area so yeah well worth a visit right let's get on to the maps and see uh, reference numbers etc if you want to drive it the lanes actually between Clawton and Chipping as you can see on the map British grid reference number is at the bottom left hand side or oh, trail wise two number again at the bottom for you mm -hmm. 